Hey guys, what's up? Newbie Snake here. So this is part two of my um, exotic weapon mission, sorry, bounty playthrough. Um, so, oh wow, hey Beastie Boy, what's up? You are so awesome. That's really fast. I just went on live, guys. Um, so, anyways, this is my part two of doing the exotic bounty right here Toland's journal and uh so after about what four tries of playing the weekly heroic strike I did it two times with you know by myself two times with my friends um the first three times we've all failed and today because I think it's because I've already leveled up myself to level 23 and I've way more sun singer skills you know, and the best part is Fireborn. Just let me revive myself. So, um, you know, I went in and tried again by myself today. And I just beat it. So, I'm showing you guys part two. So, after you guys beat um, your weekly... Sorry, sorry guys, wrong button. Uh, so, anyways, after you guys beat your weekly um, heroic strike... This will be what happens to the Tolan's journal. It'll say, oh, first I have like a check mark or some sort saying that you have earned this. And now you just need to bring the journal to Ikora Ray, the Warlock Vanguard and Tower. So again, this is my first time doing it as well. So you guys are going to experience uh, what's going to happen with me together. So, yeah, you know, I'm pretty sure we don't get it right away because I heard you have to do a lot of other stuff. So let's see what's the next part to this. Next bounty stage. Uh, let's accept bounty. Track down the fragments of Toland's journal by completing strikes on any destination. Toland obsessed over the power of the Traveler and the secrets of the darkness. His quest took him into enemy strongholds throughout the inner solar system search for more fragments there okay. so now we just need to do any sort of strikes okay uh but before i do that let me just claim some stuff from uh the crypt art sorry decode i guess <laughs> oh i see so you're on youtube bc boy and then it suddenly just notified you eh that's actually quite awesome. Did not even notice that. Uh, yeah, thanks for joining my channel. Uh, right now, I'm just going to go on any strike mission to get what we need to get. So let's see here. I just want to make sure I'm doing other bounties at the same time. Uh, kill three melee. Oh, no, sorry. With a single super use. Well, I don't know about that. I just need one more strange coin, uh, by the way, guys. I have like 12 right now. I just need one more to get uh, my first exotic gear. And I'm lucky today is Saturday. So, you know, if I get really lucky enough, I'll be able to um, get my last coin. Uh, so let's go do any strike mission to get the fragments. And um, for the purpose of collecting this, Let's just do the really, really easy ones, like level 8 mission or something. See what's a good strike. I've just done the earth strike yesterday, but that one's actually not too great. Uh, let's do something even easier. Level 12. This should be a good strike, right? Okay. Let's see. Let's just do this one. Because I don't know about the earth one. No, actually, no. The earth one's pretty easy, guys. Let's just do the earth one. Earth one's pretty good, right? Right. I just want to make sure this is, this is a strike. See, it says level 8 strike. So let's go launch and we will um 
go get our fragments. I hope I get my fragment. And it's too bad I can't check my Vanguard level and things here. So I'm not too sure. But I'm pretty sure I'm not leveled up yet, so... Or else I'll be able to get my uh, Vanguard stuff. To claw up armor. The of our city unless we strike them down. Beneath the ruins of the Cosmodrome, in the shadow of an old colony ship, we've located the House of Devil's Lair and the High Civitor feeding them their strength. We must destroy this machine god and send their souls screaming back to hell. So level 21, level 18, let's just keep everything and go all the way to where we need to because we're on a bounty here to get our um, fragments for the journal, right? So I'm going to drive this all the way up here. <laughs> it's going to be beast. Fallen Empire. Let's hope we can avoid the crossfire. Whoa, they almost killed me, guys. And, uh, yeah. My, uh, ride is on fire and it's almost, it's almost blew up on me. Alright, it's like one shot kills. You know what, since we're here, maybe I'll just level up my uh, other pulse rifle. The end game content pulse rifle. Not too sure. Ah, oh, man. Or maybe not. We just want to complete this ASAP, so I'm just going to use my most powerful gun right now, the hand cannon. Okay. So, and uh, guys, I just found out about uh, the different types of damage. Way out of your seal. The different types of damage, guys. Um, so basically, you know, there's three types of damage: solar damage, arc damage, and void damage, right? Aside from the regular physical kinetic damage, there's complex. the three. I'll need time. And, um, so apparently what the difference is, is if you actually take a look at some of the captains, well, they don't, these are not captains, but some of the captains, and, um, uh, right here. If you shoot at him, you see he glows in, uh, the blue color, right? That means if you use arc damage weapons, it will take down the shield, um, way easier. And when you take a look at those wizards, they actually glow in, uh, orange. That's the color of solar <clears throat> uh, damage. So if you use any solar damage weapon, it will take out the shield pretty fast. <clears throat> and um, lastly is the void uh, color, which is purple. So if you see anyone with purple shields, they will actually um, uh, take more damage from your void weapon. <clears throat> so the shield goes down faster. And that's that. So I've just found out that today, and I've been kind of taking that uh, advantage, which is pretty okay. You can tell my uh, sniper is solar damage by looking at the lower left hand corner, where you see I have you know, the getting secondary and third, the entire system uh, like secondary us. weapon and my heavy weapon and my primary weapon, and my heavy weapon is uh, arc damage. So yeah. I do keep different types of damage um, inside my inventory, guys, but I just don't really use that um, un unless I have to change. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Something's definitely trying to kill me. Let's 
just recharge a bit and get this big guy here. <clears throat> but just so you know, there's more fallen and hive on the way. Alright. Nice. Sorry guys, I'm just like shooting like randomly. I shouldn't be doing that. Let me just recharge a bit. Okay. And uh, let's play for real. Alright, takes a bit of aiming guys. Just don't try to shoot randomly at things. Let me turn up the mic volume for you guys because I forgot I actually turned it lower yesterday. Um, sorry about that. So for those of you who couldn't hear me earlier, uh, I will be turning it up a bit right now. So give me one quick second. Should be here. All right. I just I'm just turning up my mic volume and uh. All right, hopefully it's better now. Oh shoot, 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 shoot. What am I doing? I almost started a wrong game, sorry. Okay, I'm back. Hopefully the mic is louder and hopefully you guys can hear me better now. Okay. All right, a captain with a... Uh yellow health bar that means they're gonna be quite good I guess oh wow all right it's time to use my grenade oh wow two blues in a row so happy barrier is down we can move now I really hope I get a strange coin guys I really want to buy my exotic gear I want that arm um, piece. The arm piece is actually really cool. Glowing in like yellow. I mean, sorry, orange. Alright. Man, I'm sorry guys. After the heroic strike mission I just did, I'm just like, you know. Spamming my gun without aiming now because I feel this is way e easier, so I don't pay much attention now. Sorry, guys, shouldn't do that. The layer is up ahead under that colony ship. All right, Just the spider the is about to come out. In this case, I'm gonna save my sniper for it. All right, let's snipe. Uh, let's snipe the legs for now. Okay, can it take damage yet? Yep, good. Oops, missed. Gonna shoot at me. Alright, 695. Shoot at its legs, buddy. It's probably gonna aim at me pretty soon. Come on, minions. I'm just gonna ignore them, because I don't think they're gonna do any damage to me. So, yeah. Oh! Blew it up, guys. Look at that. How cool. Alright, let's just kill some minions because I need my, uh. Need some ammo, right? I'm just gonna close combat this dude. He's annoying me. <laughs> he flew so far back. Wow, teleportation, huh? Nope, someone else took my kill. It's okay. In this case, let's shoot a rocket launcher right to the face. Actually, no. At legs. That's where it's at. Boom. Nice hit. Do it again. Yeah. 
But uh, apparently some snipers try and kill me too at the same time. Oh shoot, missed. That was bad. <laughs> Guys, do you like that? It knocks them back so far away, it's not even funny. No, it's actually kind of funny. But, um, <laughs> yeah. I didn't even set my scorch to knock back, but I guess they're just too low level and then it's it just knocks them back. Oh, wow. Because I'm pretty sure I set it to something else, which is... Let's take a look, since it's not busy right now. Um, yeah, here. I get a flame shield. So damaging an enemy with Scorch reduces incoming damage for a short time. You know, that's the good part. And uh, while we're at this, let's just put the Angel of Light back. I really like staying up in the sky or, you know, in the midair while I, um, while I aim in midair. I really like that. It's really cool. Like this. Once you aim, you literally just stay up. That's the cool part, right? Makes aiming way more easier. I shouldn't stay with him, so if the boss shoots a rocket at us, we don't die. Oh. Oh yeah, dodged. Oh, shooting at me. We gotta get behind actually, because we need to get the second and third leg on one side and the second and third leg on the other side. Yeah, right here guys. That's it, yep, I got it. And we gotta get the last leg right there. Oh, okay. We gotta dodge. Just in case, right? Is it gone? Is it down? Nope, almost. I'm gonna throw a grenade right there. I'm just gonna burn him constantly. Look at the damage. It's not too much, but uh, this thing is so annoying. Okay. Come on, give me the leg. All right. It's constantly protecting it, but. You know what, guys? Whoa. Alright, I think we got it. Alright. Cool. I was wondering where my teammates are. Now we're at the final boss, so let's go and so this take is it out. The Devil's Lair. Oh, there's a green engram right there. I'm just gonna wait. I'm just gonna camp here. Come on. Have you sucked enough energy yet? Release yourself so I can start killing you. Alright, I think it's I think it's ready to go. Yep. Whoa. Oh man, walk by the door. Yeah.
Oh, out of ammo. So let's just go out and pick up some. Not bad. Ah, oh, keep missing. All right, need some ammo right there, and I'm just gonna pick up this buddy here. All right. Let's shoot some rocket launcher at its eyeball right there, pupil. Oh shoot. Yay. Got it. And got it. Oh man. No, 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 no. It just teleported. Okay, in this case, oh wow. Man, what are you doing in here? My room. It's my room, man. One, two, three, four. Four eye shots. That's cool. Well, really, it's a huge eyeball, anyways, but I guess we can call it pupil shot. shot pupil shot. Okay, one, two, three, oh, nope, I missed one. One, two, three, four, reload. Man, what are you guys doing here, for real? I'm trying to camp the boss and, you know, they keep trying to come in here and have some party with me. Uh, let's see. Sorry guys, that was a bad joke. <laughs> Very bad. Not even funny. Uh, anyways, let's just go out. Whoa, man, what's shooting at me? Nope, I thought that was ammo, whatever. One, two, three, four, nope. Missed the last two. You know what? Let's just... Ah! I was just gonna throw... Whoa. Blind. Right there. Sorry, guys. I almost blind myself, too. Alright. Let's see if we got any, uh... Stuff. Wait a second. And they'll find ways to Where's survive. our... Oh my goodness. They always do. Did you guys just see that? Did you guys just see that, guys? We got a plus one somewhere here around the corner. And it doesn't say anything. It just says plus one. It's like when you collected a Vanguard or any other type of bounty. But the plus one, it's really, really, really small. So you basically have to do like, what, 25 times or something like that? So, yeah, in this case, I will make a part three for you guys after I collect like, you know, 25 of them or 50 of them. I will show you guys part three and how to um, get that. So thanks so much for watching. Uh, it's it's a short one today because the sole purpose of me streaming today was to show you guys how to um, earn the exotic gear. Well, the exotic weapon, namely the Tolan's Journal. It, I remember that's what it's called. Um, I could be wrong, but check out my you know previous video in that case. Yeah, I'm so right. 25. You need 25 of them. I just made up a random number. So after you do 25 strikes, guys then you should be able to uh, move on to the next step. I'm not too sure how many steps it takes, but it's well worth it, guys. All right, so uh, have fun out there, and have some, you know, great fun on Saturday and tomorrow Sunday, so you guys have a great weekend. I might or might not be streaming in these two days. The reason why is because I've been quite busy, and after a 10... Um, you know, a uh, wedding banquet, a wedding ceremony. I have lots of friends who are getting married, uh, you know, this month and past month. So have been quite busy helping out, joining their banquet, etc., etc. 
So whenever I'm free, I will, you know, notify you guys through Twitch, uh, Twitter, Facebook. So if you guys do like what I do, please continue to follow me on Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, Twitch, and uh, be sure to subscribe. And I will see you guys again soon. So for now, I uh, hope you guys have a great day as well as a great weekend. Have fun. Bye now.